welcome back. Today we're going to discuss what is data science. And to keep it short and simple, data science is just the science of making sense of data. Um, it's usually carried out by applying a series of analytical processes and methodologies to raw data sets in order to extract actionable insights. I'm going to follow in the footsteps of Drew Conway by using a Venn diagram and the three subcomponents by which he defined data science. Those are math and statistics, coding, and domain expertise. To get started, let's talk about math and statistics requirements. In practicing data science, you're likely to be doing things like time series analysis, regression analysis, using decision trees and random forest, Monte Carlo simulations, multi-criteria decision making, and Markov chain modeling. Next, let's talk about coding. The coding requirements for data science really aren't that intensive. You could use uh, Python to do most any task in data science. Like Python libraries that are useful are the NumPy stack, which includes NumPy, SciPy, and Matplotlib for data visualization. There's also Scikit-Learn, which is great for machine learning. Um, if you're going to be working in data science, you're probably going to want to get up to speed on our statistical programming. SQL is also useful in data science for querying your data, reformatting it, and grouping it in the ways that you need in order to make your analysis. And lastly, there's also JavaScript, in particular the D3JS library of JavaScript. And that's really, these are for web programming for data visualization. So if, you're, if you need to put your output, your um, output needs to go onto the internet, uh, you might want to look into learning JavaScript and D3. Lastly, let's talk about domain expertise. Domain expertise is really what separates a data scientist from a statistician or an applied mathematician because data scientists need to have enough subject matter expertise in their area to guide them in their exploration of their data. Um, a lot of times statisticians and applied mathematicians need to call in subject matter experts to help them understand the insights that they're finding in the data set, whereas data scientists really should be skilled enough and experienced enough in their field in order to understand the insights they're finding and make decisions um, about how to proceed with the analysis based on their understanding of the field. Areas that data science is often being applied today are health, e-commerce, human resources, criminal science, business administration, and even journalism. So that's what is data science in a nutshell. And if you'd like to learn more about data science, you can pick up a copy of my book, Data Science for Dummies. It came out in March. Or um, keep an eye out, I've got some classes coming out on datamania.com. That is Statistics for Data Science, Python for Data Science, and R Programming for Data Science. So um, thanks for joining me today and have a good one.